President, last week, President Biden announced that he had lost patience with the American people and that he was demanding people get a vaccination. Now, I've had the vaccine, I'm grateful for the vaccine. It's an entirely different issue for the President of the United States to wag his finger at the American people and to say, I know what you've chosen, but I choose something different and you're going to follow me. To literally instruct every employer with 100 employees or more, every federal contractor, every federal employee to bend to the will of the President and take this injection. That's a very different thing. There are over 39 million Americans right now that we know of that have already had COVID-19, have survived it, and have natural immunity. The President's demand for vaccine ignored those almost 40 million Americans that already have natural immunity. His demand was, I know you have natural immunity, I want you to get this vaccine as well. It ignores cancer survivors that are very, very careful about what goes into their system. It ignores people with religious objections, and there are millions that have religious objections. It ignores individuals that just don't want to do it because they're an American and they don't have to. And they do not like to have a federal government instructing them what they're going to actually put in their body. 